Hey everybody, Mike Wolford here from the Dude's Kitchen and Grill and you're watching the first episode of season two. We started this on June 17th, 2019 and now it's been a year. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much for allowing us to come into your homes, on your phone, work, wherever you're watching. I really, really do appreciate it. We've got some really cool stuff coming up this year. We've got Backyard Grilling starts July 2nd, eight episode series. We've got Boat Drinks with Kelly, comes out about the same time, eight episode series. And we got Smoking with Grandpa coming out this fall. Smoking with Grandpa, what is that? Well, I'm a grandpa, for one. And two, I'm actually gonna learn how to smoke meats. And I'm gonna bring you guys along with me. I think we're gonna have a lot of fun. This year we're also gonna have guests and more reviews. So in this episode, I went to the local farmer's market here recently and I bought some bread from Oliver Friendly Foods. And these guys really, really impressed me. I'm gonna put a link down below if you're interested in taking a look at their stuff. They were super cool and they have a great story behind them. So what we're gonna do is we're going to make a grilled cheese sandwich, but not just any grilled cheese sandwich. We're gonna make it with a Granny Smith apple and applewood smoked bacon. So let's get going. Oh, don't forget, we're gonna do more uh, segments of what's Zoe doing. That's always popular. And we might throw in a couple other things here and there, you know, maybe uh, give Chris some more junk. All right, our bacon's down here. We want to cook it up. That's the boring part. While that stuff starts doing its thing, I am going to do the apple. And I'm going to do it the old-fashioned way, and I'm not going to bore you with what I'm doing with it, but you can kind of get an idea of what I'm doing. All right, guys, we'll be back in a bit. Our bacon's almost done, and I did cut the apples up into just little tiny slivers you can see right there. Here. Cut the apples up into little tiny slivers. Bacon's one of those things that, you know, you cook it to wherever you want it to be. I don't like mine crispy, but I don't like mine to be raw either. The bacon's still going to town. Now there's two different flavors. One is Parmesan, sorry, Parmesan cheddar. I have no idea what this stuff tastes like. This is the first time I'm, I'm even trying it. Looks good, it smells good. You know, little, little pieces. I do know these guys do ship pretty much everywhere. They were saying that they've shipped to 22 states so far. This one is called Dorothy's Daily. And it's more like a uh, whole wheat bread, but there's no wheat in this bread. What I'm gonna do is just, it's like a normal grilled cheese. Put some butter on one side. Perfect. this up. Looks like our bacon is done. All right guys, I'm gonna clean this up real quick and then we'll be right back. Okay, so it is time to start putting this together. So I've got the first one, which is the Parmesan cheddar. Put my piece of cheese on there. and put some apples down on this. Bacon? No, oh, bacon goes good with everything, right? that put it down on the pan 
At this point, we just treat it like any other grilled cheese. Just let it do its thing. This sandwich has been on here for five minutes. And you can see it's starting to melt. I'm liking that. It's not quite there. We're starting to get some brown on the top. I am continuously flipping it though, because I don't want it to burn. But it's the cheese we're using that makes it just a little bit longer to cook because it's it's not just your regular American cheese, it's, it's actual cheddar cheese. Let's give it a flip. Yeah, brown on there though, it's looking good. It's coming together. I Personally, I think this thing's done. So I'm gonna take this one off. I'm gonna put the next one on, but this time I am gonna actually use just the other kind of uh, cheese. Throw the apples on there. Like so. Throw a couple pieces of bacon on there. Another piece of cheese. Look at that bad boy. And there we go. Let's let this thing work its magic now. I'm gonna give it a flip. I just don't want it to burn. It's time for another episode of What is Zoe Doing? Zoe, what you doing? Huh? Just kind of hanging out? Yeah, waiting for grilled cheese? I tried something with the other one, so I'm going to do it to this one as well. Should cook it just a little bit faster. Look at that, how fast I cooked. Jeez, oh Pete. Lickety split. These are some good looking sandwiches. I think it's time to cut them up and give them a try. Let's cut them up. Cut smoothly. All right, so this one, the first one is the Dorothy's. Actually got really good flavor. You really get, you get the cheese and the, the Granny Smith apple comes right through there. And the bacon, good stuff. Mmm. That Granny Smith has a really cool sweetness to the cheddar cheese. And this is the one I'm, trying, I'm waiting for, is a Parmesan cheddar. It took, this one took forever to cook, but mmm. That's awesome. Holy moly. Wow. This taste of the bread comes right through. And it does. It tastes like Parmesan garlic. Or Parmesan cheddar. I'm sorry. You get the apple smith, bacon, you get the cheese. Oh my goodness, this is good. Mmm. Holy moly, Mrs. Dude's gonna love these things. They're amazing. All of our friendly foods, guys. Check them out, the link's below. All right, guys, that's episode one of season two. Thanks everybody for watching. I really do appreciate it. Thanks for staying out, hanging out with us to the end. Please remember to like, subscribe, ring that bell for notifications. Comment, share, dig it all. You're watching the Dude's Kitchen and Grill. And remember, the Dude abides this time with Granny Smith bacon and really cool bread grilled cheese. Talk to you later, guys.